Incredible views of Cumbre Vieja volcano is one of the most interesting volcanoes in the world at the moment. It's a hottest spot volcanism. It all started from like a far away, uh, you know, event for everyone around the world. Then the incredible images from the drones uh, came fast and quick. A colleagues in the Geological Survey of Spain were active really on this. As you can see, many vents were formed, many vents collapsed, many vents joined together, and we ended up with this view, a landscape which looks like on the moon, or another planet, like on the Io, the satellite of Jupiter. In the night, it was incredible. You didn't need a torch or anything. You could see it from a far away distance. But a close-up view with a telescope revealing this hellish place. No movie, no animation can create, no special effect can create such a hellish environment. Then we look at it closer through a drone's eye, drone's lens. This is what we see. Inferno. Dante's Inferno here. I wonder Dante had a drone. Or he could see this anyway, where he lived. And uh, the incredible views continue as the lava goes downhill, slowly going down, flowing down, then it's speeding up before reaching a flat ground that it can settle. And uh, as you can see, it's a kind of all kind of, you know, this is like a geology class. You can see Pahoyhui, you can see Ah Ah. In this case, you see Ah Ah. The, the fast speed of this uh, lava flow was so incredible. I don't think that I've seen a river of lava flowing as fast as this. Then when it reached some vegetation, that's interesting. It formed a channel, of course, when it is in, in, in uh, fast moving, it creates channels. Then burn in the trees and anything on its way, including the you know structures that we have built. Unfortunately, we we have uh, done it to ourselves, building on the way of volcanic uh, eruptions, then reaching the sea. This is something from another world, times gone by, Jurassic probably. And when we look at it from the air, this all looks so logical. Cambria Vieja volcano is on the foothill of a bigger volcano. And as it reaches the sea, it adds to the landmass. This is what we have now. An island adding to its area.